Hello, and today I'm going to show you how to fix another common problem, like one of my last videos, which is the invalid Steam user ID ticket. Now this one's been going around for ages, and like it's going to be ages to find anything about it. So, um, it, it'll it happen on quite a lot of games on Steam, but you should only have to do this once. So basically what you need to do, you need to egg, you need to close down Steam, that's the first thing. So you press exit and you close it down. I'm not going to do that because I'm, I'm not going to do what I'm about to do. So I'm just going to leave it open, but you have to close it down. So what you need to do, you need to go into computer, like press start, computer. Or if you're on Windows XP, it'll be uh, my computer, hopefully. Um, I was just checking if my mic was muted. <laughs> yeah. Um, so uh, when you've done that, go to local disk. I've got quite a lot of files. Uh, if, if, if you haven't got times 86, it'll be in normal program files. So go into here, go into down at the bottom to Steam, and then see you'll hit, see a corner there. Uh, config. Oh my god. Okay, config folder. Yeah. And you'll see this. Just right click it and delete it, and then empty out your recycle bin as well, just to make sure. Now you have to make sure Steam's closed down before you delete this. And when it has, like when it's closed down. Uh, when you've deleted that folder, emptied out a recycle bin, reopen Steam, and it should go back to the first thing where it says like create a, a new account or use your PS3 one or log into an existing one. So log back in, and then you need to go into your email address account if it's on MSN, Yahoo, whatever. And you need to reauthenticate your um, your like username, like you know account, because it says you got a new computer, but you haven't because you just deleted the config folder. And now that should re-authenticate your user ID ticket. I don't know why it happens, it just happens randomly. So if that doesn't work, there is a another option, but that should work. This is the one that should work. Um, but if it doesn't, I've got another one. So quickly go into computer. This is only if it doesn't work and you've deleted your config folder. Oh, by the way, if if you log it, if um, you delete your config folder, and it lets you log back in without an off uh, off uh, Authentication. There you go. Authentication. Then you need to log back out, log out, and then log in, and then log in again and see if it authenticates. If not, just wait a bit until it tells you to re-authenticate your thing because it it won't change anything. So quickly go back into your Steam folder, which is down here, and then you'll see two things here, which are these two: app status dot blob and and client registry dot blob. You need to delete these two. Right, do right, do the, uh, don't do this if you haven't done the config one yet. If you haven't done the config, and if the config one works, don't do this. I'm just going to tell you loads of times because sometimes this one is a bit dodgy because it didn't work for me. You need to delete these two and put them in your recycle bin, empty them, then just reopen Steam. You need to close Steam down again, by the way. Uh, close Steam down, and when you load it back up, it'll start updating because you've deleted like updates, and then when you've gone on. <laughs> it's not a guarantee it would work, but it is a suggestion. It's been a suggestion everywhere on the internet. Uh, but um, they're the only two I know that would work for this. Uh, so if these two don't work, then I can't really help you from there. So don't start saying, oh, how, uh, it doesn't work, blah, blah, blah. Because I won't be able to help you. Anyway, I do hope this helps. Thanks. Uh, bye.